Hey everybody, so uh, a couple things. We've got the new GTA 6 trailer, so that just uh, got dropped, and it's been, what, like 10 years since the last GTA came out, and um, I won't play it on here, but I'll link it below. You can also check out Rockstar Games' uh, YouTube channel to watch it. It's, you know, a real short one, but it's essentially based uh, kind of like in Vice City, so um, I think this one's going to be pretty cool. So, I, I'm i super pumped for this. I'm a big gamer. Um, I know I don't talk a lot about games on here, but anyways, just wanted to mention that for anybody that did not see that yet. That's into gaming. So, on to the, the topic, and this is going to be pretty quick. Uh, the Autodesk Data Connector. So I'm actually pretty behind on this. Uh, this article was posted last month, but it's about the data connector through Power BI, and it's supposed to connect to their like ACC stuff. So um, uh, like your Revit models on BIM 360. The examples I see here and the examples I saw in GitHub all had room information in it. Now. I don't know how much data is here or if it's like the data that we have access to is similar to if we were to do an ODEBC export to like an access database um, or you know how much flexibility we have in that if we have to create all of our relationships and stuff in Power BI or how I don't know how exactly that's gonna work but I thought this was pretty cool to mention now, I did go out to the site because I think to access it, yeah, right here. And it's free. I don't know if it's still like in this beta thing. Or I think everybody can get access to it. Now, I haven't tested this yet. I plan on uh, messing around with it and then talking about it on the channel. I just don't know if I can share any real examples because uh, I don't have ACC. Uh, in my own account, I have it at work, and so I'd have to um, just kind of see what I can do there and how I can share and talk about that. But anybody that is using Autodesk Data Connector, I'd love to hear uh, kind of your insights. How how how's it been working for you? Um, I don't, you know, I think this is a good direction. You know, building tools like this, but I'm still more of a fan of like Speckle and just the fact that I can you know, create an instance of that and start uploading models immediately and connecting that into Power BI, where here I can't even test this because I don't have an ACC account. I don't have one uh, for, you know, for personal use. I have a work one, but I don't have one for personal use and it's not like free to set up the collaboration stuff and all of that, unfortunately. So I don't think this is something to ignore if you're using Revit and ACC, it might be really useful. I love Power BI. You can connect into so many different things. So if you can pull that data into a dashboard and then connect it to other data sources, you might be able to tell a really good uh, story or a good practical um, uh, kind of a dashboard that could be used to make actual decisions on a project. I've done that with projects, but I've never used a, a, a data connector that connects directly to the cloud. If I'm pulling data from there, I'm exporting it uh, most of the time or doing something with the API to pull data. So anyways, comment below if this is something you're using. I'd love to hear it, but just wanted to mention this because uh, in case nobody heard it, heard about it yet and uh, kind of see what, what how people are using it and what, what others' thoughts are. So anyways, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.